Tensions flared in Murrieta, California, as anti-immigration protesters vowed to continue their fight against the transfer of undocumented immigrants to their town. It's not about race, it's about resources. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Murrieta does not have the resources to support this influx of people. They come for the American dream, and if we really want to live up to what we're saying, then we should accept them. A large crowd of both anti- and pro-immigration protesters gathered at the Murrieta Border Patrol Station Friday to await the arrival of buses expected to carry 140 undocumented immigrants. But unlike Tuesday, when about 200 fervent protesters waving American flags blocked three busloads of immigrants, authorities made sure to completely clear the entry road to the facility Friday morning. By late Friday afternoon, there was no sign of those buses, and many demonstrators decided to head home. But not before six people were arrested. Murrieta police told the Desert Sun one woman was arrested on suspicion of battery of an officer, and four others were handcuffed after allegedly interfering with police. The Los Angeles Times reports federal officials said earlier this week 140 immigrants would arrive in Murrieta Friday. But after Tuesday's blockade, officials decided not to announce the schedule, citing security concerns. Those immigrants are mostly women and children and are part of an exodus from Central America that has caused the U.S. Border Patrol headaches for months. A mix of poverty and violence is prompting the mass movement. Gang violence, especially in Honduras and El Salvador, is a big factor. But as this graph from Vox points out, other nearby countries have recently seen an increase in the number of immigrants, including Mexico, Panama, and even Nicaragua, which is one of the poorest countries in the world. According to Border Patrol officials, the buses that were headed to Murrieta Friday were rerouted to a station in Chula Vista that night. It's unclear if those buses will make their way to Murrieta at some point. For Newsy, I'm Elizabeth Hagedorn, multiple sources of broader view.